Look at that! Yellow tail snapper, baby! Come on, man. Literally, biggest one of the day. Oh my God. And we got this huge yellow tail. <laughs> Come over here, buddy. Stay inside. I right hear you make your line, you make your cutout. All right, watch this, fans. It's David and me, Beepo George. We've got kids in the background stuff, so there might be a little extra noise, but we are gonna do a catch and cook and eat. On Yellowtail Snapper, we're down in the Florida okay. Keys, and we are going, we've loaded up on Yellowtail Snapper, guys. One of the best eating fish around, and we've got, me Beepo is going nuts over here cooking some Yellowtails. We're gonna show you some simple, simple recipes that you can make with pretty much any snapper, but, you can be on. You can just say, just say, hey, say, watch your lip, and you can be on. Watch your lips, your lips. There you go. You're on. All right, guys, like it, like the video, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, and we are going to show you a catch, clean, cook, and eat video. We're into one on. All right, watch your lip. Yellow tail time. Literally, biggest one of the day. Oh, my God. oh, get him up, get him up, get him up. Yeah. Man, we got this huge yellow tail. <laughs> That's a flag right there, baby. Measure it? Yeah, let's measure it. Let's measure it. He is, what, 17 and a half? 18. Almost 18 inches. George got the hook set on film. Yeah, yeah. Come on, man. Get him up. What? All right, George, tell me, dude, what you got there? This is called a yellow tail. Yellow tail, baby. And That's a, a beauty, yellow too. yellow tail because the tail is yellow. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Look how beautiful. Oh, that's pretty. Like that. he, is he keeper, George? Uh, he's a keeper. He's All right, Lorenzo's hooked up one more time. Come on, buddy boy. Lorenzo's flatlining. Hopefully this is a nice big flag yellowtail. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? He's digging. He's yellow digging. Yellowtail. Come on, get him in. Nice. Dude, that's that's the fish of the trip right there. Awesome fish, buddy, here. Dude, look at that guy, man. That is He's 15 inches all day. Yeah. All day, man. That's flag right there. That's flag material. You wanna know why they call him a flag? Cause that right there, baby, that is a flag. He's advertising himself. Nice. Warm right up with it. a little one? Huh? Warm up with a little one? No, man, I'll go right for it. Guys, love this. Now we get to fillet our yellowtail snapper. Uh, this is a great white meat, guys. Um, you fillet him much like any other fish. There's not, not really a whole lot of trick to it. Um, you just kind of go up along this rib cage or this uh, top line right here. You make your line, you make a cutout all the way down. You make a cutout right along his belly. And then before taking the filet, I like to go right over to the other side. Do the same thing, make our line. And then, say we're gonna cut here. I need to go this way. Make our line up. Okay, now, lines are made. Now we cut along the rib cage. Mm -hmm. Might need to get a little. Maybe I should have warmed up on a small one. Mm. Before I take the fillet off, I like to flip it over, get the other side. Bam, one. Two, fishy, he go bye bye. Then, 
take our our fillet and we skin it. Like that. Like that. Then last step is just cut the rib cage out and we are done. Got the ribs, got a little little pokey guys here. A little Pokemon action. I'm gonna cut that out. And now we've got a nice, nice filet right there, guys. That's yellowtail, baby. Some good stuff. <gasps> Same thing on this one. Hey guys, only uh, 17 more to go. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. So, this looks like an amazing situation we got going on here. Would you agree? The pots are very amazing. The pots are not amazing. We are in a, a, a literally a motel room. So, so that one's not really getting too hot. So okay. I already made three batches here. So oh, look really at that. Fun. So, George, why don't you tell us what is going on right now? Well, what did you do with these uh, yellowtail snapper fillets? All right, so we got a little... Um, pre-mix because you know it's a blackened mix blackening mix yep because we're in a hotel we don't really have all our usual spices yeah so that'll that'll be good it's very versatile okay. are there any that are not spiced yet these are not spiced. okay leave me leave me like one or two little fillets for sashimi oh okay well you know what so i got these are mangroves okay these are the ones that left with the skin and then these are the, the yellowtail. All right, so yeah, just leave me a couple little pieces of yellowtail for sashimi, so. All right, so you you put a little blackening season. What else you got on there? A little salt. I like a little 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 salt. Little salt? Yeah, because okay. salt just makes it taste a little bit better. All right. And guys, we filleted these in the dark, which is not the smartest thing, because yeah. handling fillet knives in the dark. Yeah. But. Uh, so I'm, I'm hoping that we get all the spines out, little all butter. the, a little bit of butter, and that's it. It's just like a, a little sautéing pan, right? That's it, man. Yellowtail snapper. There's so many ways you can cook them. It is good, man. But um, they're, I mean, they're they're very. It's a very good fish. Very white meat. Uh, it's very highly favored, especially down here in South Florida in the Keys. And uh, and you'll see why in a minute because we're gonna have everybody taste it. How does it taste, dude? I have. Tastes very good. <laughs> I was gonna say I haven't tasted it yet, but I couldn't lie. You couldn't lie. All right, George, tell me what, what do you do with the skin on? You gonna do the same thing? Yeah. So you know what? Let's film it with the skin on. I just want to see, show you the beautiful color that the skin gets on a hot pan. Okay. Can't wait. All right. So literally, it's just blackening season. A little bit of salt. Watch out, bud. A little bit of salt. Rebecca is dying to be on there. So, George, you like to leave the skin on, don't you? Okay, hold on. Let me see what this looks like here. Wish it were a little bit hotter. A little bit hotter? Would be better? Okay. It looks good. Up. And, and, and why do you like the skin on? What does that do for you? It just gives it a little crisp. It's All right, nice, so it's a nice texture thing. Here we go. Look at that one here. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm never doing a little bit better. Ready to go? Ready to go? Oh, that's awesome. It's a feast, huh? It's a feast. It's a feast. All right, guys, check this out. So when are these ready to flip here? 
Ready to go? Okay. These got skin on them. Well, to each his own, George. Uh, we'll we'll see. Try. We'll see. I'm going to try it. I'm going to try. Usually I, I de-skin all my fish. George is insisting that yellowtail snapper skin cooked on the filet is awesome. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? So that's a mangrove. That's a mangrove. Yellowtail. Okay. And I noticed that the yellowtails have a little a little bit of a more crunchy rib cage as you're trying to fillet through. And What's more sturdy meat too? Which one? The, the mangrove. Mangrove is more sturdy meat. A little, little tough, a little... Yeah, we, when we were trying to fillet these guys in the dark, it was a little interesting. But man, come on dude, look at all that meat. This is a feast guys. I cannot wait to sink my teeth in the yellow cell snapper. What about you? Yeah. You're gonna eat it? Yeah. You're gonna be happy? Yeah. Did you try one already, Rizabella? Yes. You did? How was it? Good. It was good? Okay. Awesome. All right, folks, so George insisted that I would try his yellowtail snapper with the skin on. I got a piece with skin, a piece without skin, and I'm just going to put a little bit of lime on it. And guys, George, which one first, with or without skin? Blindfolded. Blindfolded. <laughs> How about this? I'm going to go with skin. This is yellowtail with the skin. So good, man. It's like, I don't know if you can see this, how white this meat is, guys, but it is just delicious. Um, oh, it's so good. Mmm. Oh, so good. Well, I'm very happy, guys. We're going to have a yellowtail snapper feast. Simo, are you going to eat some? Yeah. Yes? Okay, good. We're going to have a yellowtail snapper feast, but um, I'm just going to go, let's go over it and see how the kids like it in a few minutes as soon as George is done cooking these. What? Mm -hmm. Amazing. Look at that yellowtail snapper, baby. Come on, man. Let's dig in. Let's dig in. That is a mountain of yellowtail snapper. Way to dig in. Okay, Isabella, Isabella, Isabella Layout is going to be our first contestant on the Yellowtail Snapper. Is right, it, Isabella. Are you ready? Yeah. On a scale of one to ten, you're going to tell me what you think about Yellowtail Snapper. Why don't you go ahead and scale of one to ten? <laughs> That's a ten. Ten? Yeah. Whoa! Perfect ten. All right. Rebecca, Rebecca, no. she's gonna give us a scale of one to ten. Like Rebecca, like you like it? Like you, like you like it? it? Rebecca likes it. Ten. Ten? You got two tens. You got two. George, you got two tens, but all right. Sophie. Let's do this. That is so good. Is it good? You like it? All right. Scale of one to ten. Uh oh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, it just it just went down a quarter of a point. Half a point. You got us fine. Uh, hey, it was a dark. Yeah, it was we flayed in the dark, guys. Give nine. us a break. A nine. I would have given it a nine and a half of the Hold on. Bone. Lucas, go ahead, buddy. Take a big bite of our yellowtail extravaganza. You like it? Yeah? Scale of one to ten. Ten and a half. Ten and a half! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right, Samuel, come on up over here, buddy. Grab yourself a piece. We're going to make it happen. Don't forget the lime. Don't forget it. You're going to put a little lime on it? Yeah. All right. There you go. All right, let's go. Let's make it happen. That's amazing, lime. That's really good. A 10? Ding, 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 ding. Wow. Yeah. All right, Lorenzo, Lorenzo, this is your yellowtail snapper, buddy boy. Well, I'm not sure which one is the ones you caught, but either way. All yours. It's fantastic, right? Wow. Wow. It's a wow. Nine and a half. Nine and a half? Yeah. Okay. All right. All right, Vanessa, are you, you one in? Team Vanessa, Team Vanessa, Team Vanessa. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Uh, 
My my, all right. Tia Vanessa, coming at you. And we got a request from her that we do a nice fried fish episode. We're gonna do that soon. Okay. I love it with the lime. Love it with the lime? Fantastic. Okay. What do you what do you give it? That's a ten. To ten. That's a lot of tens, man. See George, you That's want to try a lot of tens. masterpiece? George, come on over here, buddy. Well, I'm gonna be uh, what do you call it? You're biased. Bias. Yeah, you're a little biased. Bias. A little bit of bias. Hold on. It's alright, it's alright. You gotta go like this, hold on. Hold on, let's spread it out a little bit. Am I the only one that got the bone? Like, all right, yeah, let's, yeah. let's make it rain. We gotta make it rain. Make it a rain. Oh. Oh. Okay. Wait, right. Wait, there's one more. All right, here we go. Two, two. Okay. okay. Here it goes. Five is awesome. Five plus five. <laughs> plus ten. The ten. Yeah. Whoa, awesome. I didn't know that. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> I need an assistant full. Yeah. I yes, got. Timmy, baby. Is she gonna come and do it? All right. Yay! 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 No Emmy in the house! All right. All right. Okay. I don't want any other hands in here. All right. Which piece will she take? Oops, I almost dropped it. Eat it. Take a nice big chunk. Yeah. It already has lime. What do you think? Can I share with you? Share. There's a mountain of fish there. <laughs> it's good. Yeah, it's good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Coffee. Okay. Uh oh. Wait, 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 all right. <laughs> I'm overthinking it, that's why. All right. So, honey, what, what would be a 10? What would make it a 10? Like, like, a little more blackened. Yeah. All right. You want more spice? Yep. Okay. But the fish taste itself, like the, the fish is fresh tail. and it's good. We're not ranking the cook, we're ranking the fish. Like awesome. The fish taste. All right, guys. Really clean, really good. Okay. Oh, oh my. Oh. I got it. Chopsticks. Okay. Right. So. Thank you, boys. I'm going to give it a nine. No reason. What? No, no plus. <laughs> <laughs> the only reason um, is, you know, I, I think there could be a little bit more, a um, little bit more texture to the, to the fish, but the it's taste is phenomenal. It's a very soft meat. So, oh. Yeah, so I prefer a little bit more of a, a firmer meat. This one, this is a very soft meat. I mean, I'm just tearing it up like we're about to serve you dinner. Bro. I haven't eaten yet. Yeah, guys. okay, all right. Anyway, so guys. He did eat some rice. He did eat rice. Chicken. And chicken. So guys, love Yellowtail Snapper. There's a million ways to cook it. There's a million ways to cook Yellowtail. And uh, guys, this is just one, we just made it real quick. I better get in here before these kids eat all my food. Um, and so, if you like the video, give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe, guys. You guys all gave it a 10. Yeah. 10. I gave it a nine. And she gave it a nine. All right, but we actually also um, have some sashimi in the freezer. Woo! So, guys, I uh, hope you like that. Uh, if you yeah. want to check out the sashimi try, just wait until after the outro and then we'll show you that. Guys, take care. God bless. Stay safe. Watch your lips. Sophie is our sashimi critique. Sophie, tell me, you're just sprinkling soy sauce all over. All right, here we go. Tell me, what do you think about sashimi yellowtail snack? I like it. I like it. Yeah? All right, tell me about it, sweetie. Um, it's good, but it's really chewy. A little bit more chewy? Okay. There's so many bloodlines. Yeah, there's so, it's really, really Chewy. It's a thinner fillet, so it's typically not something that you would do a sashimi with. <laughs> okay. Anyway, it's not something that we typically do a sashimi with, but we figured we'd try it just to see. 
how it's it would not, be. It's not my favorite. Okay. But you'd still eat it. I'd eat it. Okay. You're still doing it's, it. It has a weird texture. Alright, here they Always right. hungry for sashimi. Alright. Sashimi time for me. Get the one with the bloodline. I got a little bit of bloodline. I don't mind a little bit of bloodline. Here no, we go, guys. Okay. A little bit of yellowtail sashimi. <laughs> Isn't it like weird? Yeah. <laughs> That's because you left it in the freezer. Yeah. It's weird. It, yeah, it's definitely not the best sashimi. Maybe a thicker fillet would work better, but um. Anyway, so good. All right. Anyway, next till next time. Watch your lip. Cook your cook your yellowtail. Yes. <laughs> watch your lip. Watch the bones. Watch your lip. Rebecca, say watch your lip. Watch your lip. Rebecca, say it. Watch the bones. Watch your lip. Rebecca, say watch your lip. We want to end it with you, Rebecca. Say watch your say. lip. Watch your lip. Your hands off of her head, Bobby. Go. Rebecca. What? Okay, everybody leave her alone. Let her be. Listen, on the second time, just don't say it. When they say one, two, three, everybody say, watch your lip. And then on the second time, you do the one, two, three, then, and everybody quiet. Okay, Rebecca. Everybody say, watch your lip. All right, everybody say, watch your lip. On three. One, two, three. Watch your lip. It's not going to work. Again, one, two, three. One, two, three. Yeah, man, man. <laughs>